My name is Craig McDowell. I'm an artist here in Merriman. Uh, I'm working on a solo art exhibit uh, that will be in a college gallery. And it's a, a real nice gallery, a bona fide space, um, excellent people to work with. And it's going to be a good show. The problem is, at this moment in life, I don't have a show. Um, I've, I've got pieces of a show, I've got this or that, I've got ideas, I've got drawings, but I don't have a show. Um, I have about nine to ten months from this time to put together a show for next October, and that's what this uh, video series is going to be about. Uh, I'm going to just share with you, in small bits and pieces, uh, the process of putting together a big show like that. I don't have a whole bunch of preconceived notions because um, my background is definitely in the fine arts. I also have the last 20 years, 25 years of being a graphic designer. So I've been working with all the elements of art for all these years. Also, and I'll explain this in a future video, but one of the reasons I'm in Maryland is because I wanted to go to the, the famous museums and galleries. Um, and I'll definitely talk about that in some video. This is not an instructional set of videos. It's not intended to be. It won't be. Um, I've got shop skills, and I've got carpentry skills, and I've got real life skills, and I've worked on farm equipment. I've worked on a lot of cars. I know my way around a shop. I know my way around tools. And uh, if I see something or note something that, that might be interesting to you, I'll, I'll certainly mention it. Uh, my goal is to share the creative process with you more than instructional kinds of things. And I'm going to try to be upbeat and positive along the way, well really all the time. I, I, that's my personality. I'm an extrovert. and If you're going to be an extrovert, you need to be a positive person or no one cares. <laughs> um, at the same time though, I am a creative person. I'm an emotional person. I'm a uh, I wear my emotions kind of on my sleeve, as they say. I, ref I reflect on my own thoughts a great deal. And the creative process is not always upbeat and fun. Sometimes you're trying to develop an idea, and it's hard. It's like a workout. And, and it's, it's just difficult to reach into your brain and into your soul and into your, your heart and decide, what is this thing really going to be? What am I after? What am I even doing here? Um, and, and do I have something to say? And, and the last thing I want this to be, whether it's this YouTube channel right now that you're watching, or the art show itself, I don't want either one of them to be a vanity project. Um, it's just it's just the wrong attitude for what I'm trying to accomplish. So I just want to invite you to come along. Along the way, you'll you know get a tour of my shop and see the things I work with. You'll see the materials I work with. Uh, you'll see the struggles I have with all of the above. Um, but I, my intention is to keep these videos short. Uh, I would like to have maybe twice a week a four to six minute video uh, that you can that you can come and watch. Um, the one reason I'm keeping the video short is because I am keeping my eye on the goal, my eye on the prize, and that is the art show in October. I, I want to make a sculpture and then share that with you. And what this will culminate in, I, and I didn't even I never even thought about this until tonight when I was on take, you know, four, and I realized when we get to the gallery show, the exhibit, in October, uh, I think it's a fun idea to live stream from that show and, and, and share that moment with people who have followed me for a little while and would be interested in seeing what that event is like. It could be, you know, this is not the Met, this is not going to be a gala, but, uh, you know, it, it, it is a, a First Friday's event at, the, at, at a nearby town, and uh, there's always a good turnout, and... I think I'll finally finish this whole series by going through the gallery uh, during the day and, and just taking a look at each piece and maybe trying to shoot that in the round. I don't know. I mean, we'll see what I make, right? Because uh, that's part of the deal here is I don't know what this show is going to look like. 
I'm going to be developing an all, this sounds crazy to me, I'm going to be developing an all new body of work, basically from scratch, with some ideas like this, you know, sketched uh, like yesterday, and, and I'm going to see where that goes. Uh, so again, we'll, we'll try to keep them short, not instru instructional to speak of. I uh, see a lot of tour of the shop as I work, and uh, we're going to have a lot of fun along the way. And this show will be, um, I think, well worth my time. I, I'm, I'm literally committing 2,000 hours to this show uh, because I think it's worth my time. And I've never been better equipped, either personally, health-wise, or even with my shop and my space, to do this show. I'm in a, in a great space. My wife supports me, and uh, I've got some money. So I'm really looking forward to doing this show. And I hope that you'll join me along the way. Tune in just once in a while. Tune in regularly, whatever. Um, but you're welcome to join me. All right. Good day.